really lovely here. Last time we recorded the album in south of London, in the busy city. And this time we are here, only 30 minutes away from the capital of Finland, Helsinki, in Sipo. Middle of nowhere. So we've been recording this album here in E-Studio with recording engineer Lauri Hämäläinen. And then I wanted to have a bit of an international vibe on the album and uh, I found mixing engineer Chris Bell from Austin, Texas. And he's done some legendary bands like Eagles, Erika Badu and also one of my favorite North Mississippi All-Stars. So he also suggested me to master the album in Los Angeles by Gavin Larson, uh, who was a Grammy awarded mastering engineer. And I really like the album he, he done for Robert Plant and Alison Grouse a few years ago. And for me it's really important that I can concentrate on, on the songs and telling the story. And that's why I love it when I can just come upstairs here and think of the lyrics what I want to say about those and have a, like as genuine feeling I can have on each song. And uh, while we have 24 hours every day to do the recording, we choose not to overload ourselves, but but take breaks. And during the breaks, we we might might make food together and just enjoy telling jokes and whatever. Yeah, there's a lot of things that kind of happen during the recording process. You, um, you might change some musical ideas on the way. Uh, you might even change the story on the way. And that's why I love songwriting, because you don't know where, where it's gonna end, where the story is gonna end. It's like writing a book, a small book, very small book, just a few verses in it. I've been recording this whole album with my 1968 Super Reverb amp, 4 times 10 I'm loving it. This is my touring amp as well. Old and reliable. Custom shop, Fender. Few of them actually. <laughs> this is my favorite one. I've done most of the solos with this guitar on the album. Eric Johnson model. Eric Johnson is from Austin. I love Eric's stuff. Yeah. And this is an old Tokai Stratocaster from 80s. And I saved it from a school. They were gonna ditch it. And I said, oh, I'll take it. It's gonna find a better home now. We can. Most of the slide guitar trucks I've done with my GNL Z3 Semi Hollow. This has been staying with me uh, over a decade. And it's, it's my favorite guitar really and now it's out of tune uh, I've, I have really great band in the studio with me they also my touring band Tatu Back on bass Ipe Laitinen on drums and Harri Taitonen on keyboards and Hammond and they are so much fun to work with they're flexible we listen to each other and uh, we respect each other which is very important when you make music together I'm Harry Taitonen and uh, I'm playing on, on the new album where they are into the keyboard tracks there and uh, I've had the pleasure of playing with Eria for the last 10 years or even more than that. I've been sort of uh, 
and um, just a couple of words on how, how we've been doing this project. I mean, we, we did the kind of the bass tracks in the studio. That's they, they had a fantastic uh, gear also on the keyboard side. But now I'm doing a bit of an icing on the cake. I'm I'm doing some keyboard tracks with the Fender Rhodes here. Uh, it's a classic. Uh, love love that. And uh, Hammond C3, which has been my tool in every album we've made with Area and uh, obviously some more modern gadgets here. So with these we are trying to make as good sound as possible. Hey there, it's Jennifer Benton from Michael Jackson and Jeff Beck's bands and I'm happy to announce that I'm on Area's new record on a song called Snake in the Grass. Super badass, beautiful vocals, beautiful composition and she wrote a, a killer harmonized line for us to play together so I'm looking forward to playing that live and having y'all hear it on the record. Enjoy. We can find